Glenn and Tracy in the morning. As soon as I wake up. As soon as I wake up. I wake up and turn it on. 98.1 The Hawk. You know, not often do we get visitors. And uh, with us, let's welcome all the way from Afton, New York. It's Hunter, Hunter Pease. Good morning, Hunter. Welcome to the Hawk Morning Show. Good morning. Twin Tears Honor Flight is this amazing nonprofit organization that sends our local veterans to their monuments in Washington, D.C. And generally, the guys who go and the ladies who go, they're up there in years. So this is usually their first and last chance to get to go to their monuments. So a couple weeks ago... There was a spaghetti dinner, and we were auctioning off an in-studio experience with the Hawk Morning Show. And uh, tell us what happened from there, Hunter. Oh, uh, well, I went and, you know, took a chance and I ended up winning it. And I was kind of <laughs> surprised. I was like, oh, boy, I don't know. This, this is going to be interesting, you know? <laughs> so uh, do you have any involvement with the Twin Tears Honor Flight? Like, what made you go to the benefit? I don't have involvement. My sister does, and uh, Maddie Lopke, she's a like a representative for it, and uh, uh, my grandfather, you know, he's a he's a veteran, and we took him, and he uh, wants to go on the flight and uh, go mm. see. Uh, it's mostly World War II and Vietnam veteran yeah. era guys, and it'd just be nice to see, you know, veterans and stuff go. And I think it's a great thing that you guys did what you did for them. Oh, well, I, we think it's great that you went to the benefit, and we think it's awesome what the Twin Tiers Honor Flight is doing. And, you know, just to put this into perspective for you, it costs roughly $70,000 for mm. one honor flight. They've got to get a commercial airplane, the wheelchairs and the aids, and they've got to get all just everything. You think about all of that. They they provide them with a meal. There's a lot of stuff that they do for the vest. So $70,000 is what Twin Tiers Honor Flight, about $70,000 is what they have to come up with just for one one honor flight trip, which is crazy, right? It is. But it's awesome that you participated. Yeah. We think that's great. We're going to talk more with Hunter. There is a reason why you're in here so early, but we'll talk about that. And uh, whatever. going to blow up your spot, Hunter. Whatever you want to talk about, Hunter, yeah. this hour is yours. <laughs> Binghamton's number one for new country. Not even put on the Hawk. Hawk Morning Show, Glenn and Tracy in our in studio experience today with Hunter Pease from Afton. Good morning. Tell us a little bit about yourself, Hunter. You're from Afton, but there's a reason why you're, you're coming in so early this morning. Yeah, I work a lot. Of hours. Tell us <laughs> what you do. We just recently got done finishing a big project up at the airport. Uh, we repaved the main runway. Uh huh. So it's been kind of rough, long hours. And uh, now we're going to move on to Belden Hill on 88 and uh, Oneana 88 job. Are you the 88 West guy? Yep. That's like, you said seven miles think, long? Yeah, it's like seven miles. Do you know the 88 song? No. It is the road that never Run. ends. <laughs> yes, it goes on and on, my friends. <laughs> Some people started driving it, not knowing what it was. <laughs> That's going to be in your song. Your head the whole time you're paving. <laughs> Is there anybody you want to give a shout out to this morning? Uh, I don't know. Maybe my boss, Shane Freeman, for letting me come out here today. <laughs> well, it's awesome. I hope you're enjoying your stay so far. Of course. All right. Hunter Pease from Afton. What did you vision that this might look like? Is this anything like you thought it might be? No, not really. Do you think it was going to be more chaotic than it is? A little bit. A little yeah. bit. Or, or are we calmer than you think? Yeah. We're just warming up. We're <laughs> <laughs> getting here before, before Tracy's coffee is fully kicked in. I know. So. I haven't even finished the whole cup yet. Yeah. Awesome. Hunter Pease from Afton is our in-studio guest today. He won the, the experience. Uh, once again, thank you for your participation in helping out with the uh, Honor Flight uh, the fundraiser at my oh, yeah. We think that is so fantastic. I have a feeling that's a song you're going to hear at the next Taste the Country Music Festival. Eric Church, that is love. You're loved the most. If you haven't heard, he's going to be the headliner for next year. It's June 8th through the 10th. Pre-sale tickets are available right now at 981thehawk.com. You only have through tomorrow. So today, tomorrow is it. Then uh, they go bye-bye for a little while, and then prices go up and all that. Big up to number one for New Country, 981 the Hawk Hawk Morning Show, Gun and Tracy. Hunter Pease from Afton is with us. Now, you're saying you're, you're a big Eric Church fan. Yep. And that, that would be a show that you wouldn't mind seeing. No, I, I'd definitely like to go see that one. Have you been to the Taste of Country Music Festival before? I was, I was there uh, the first year they had it. Year. That was the one with Willie Nelson, right? Yep, Willie yeah. Nelson and uh, Lady Annabelle was there. Justin Moore. Uh, I remember Justin Moore was like Dustin kind of, Lynch was yeah. there. They were like nobody's yeah. back yeah, then. Yeah, look at them now. And I will tell you, Justin Moore and Dustin Lynch were probably two of the best concerts out of that whole weekend. Really? And, I do re- and I do remember back then, because people were talking about this Justin Moore guy and they, a lot of people were saying that he was one of the best he was what was your experience like it seems like every friday except for this year the friday night at hunter mountain taste the country music festival was wet very wet so that was not a lie no no, no. 
No. <laughs> Why would people lie about <laughs> it being wet? Well, I'm, I'm trying to lead in here. It's called leading. It, it was, it was, so what was, it was your a little too wet. With it. Okay, so it, what happened? I don't know. It, was, it rained all night. The next day, we woke up. Tents are full of water and stuff, so we had to go down, oh, wow. find a laundry mat. Did you? How, was the was it crowded? I would imagine there would have been a lot of people there. No, nah, there was nobody there. I, I think I was up <laughs> earlier than everybody you else. You were the only so person who like, wanted to be dry. Everybody like, else was yeah. like, yeah. Everything I owned was literally <laughs> soaked. Anything and everything I had in my possession. The car was like four miles away. Oh my goodness! Oh, had to oh, like my goodness. walk four miles. Ended up like hitchhiking. I'll be and I'll both ways. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Those have you ever oh, been to Hunter Mountain? Yeah, it's all hills. It's all yeah. hills. It's all hills. Both ways. It's a good calf workout. <laughs> How was Willie? Willie was awesome. Did he play a long time? Uh, Do you remember? I think it was there a half hour or an hour. Oh, okay. I think that's all it was. But it was a downpour rain. Oh yeah. So. That's, oh, that's so right. That, yeah. that were the crowds. There was a lot of people, that's for a sure. A lot of people. A lot of people. How about the way they acted? They were a fun crowd. Everybody was there to have a good time, and everybody, I think, managed to have a good time. Well, I think especially for the people that are staying there for the three days, you figure, we all are here together. We might as well try and get along, you Everybody know? we camped next to was yeah. all just, you know, there was... It was all fun. Everybody was sharing everything, you know, like, hey, That's cool. you know, come over, you can have some of this, you know, come over <laughs> the whole time. That's the way to do it, right? It was fun. I, it was actually the year I graduated high school. It was probably the <laughs> funnest times of my life. <laughs> nice. Hunter Pease from Afton needs our guest this hour. He won the in-studio experience. Won it through the Honor Flight uh, funders they had at McGurk's. Mm-hmm. And you can read more about the Twin Tiers Honor Flight at 91thehunt.com keyword. Twin Tiers on our flight. 98.1, The Hawk.